Always follow your installation instructions. This video is for information purposes only. Follow these instructions to connect a four-wire power supply cord to your electric dryer for use in a four-wire receptacle. A four-wire connection is required for mobile homes and where local codes do not permit the use of three-wire connections. Warning, fire hazard. Use a new UL-listed 30-amp power supply cord. Use a UL-listed strain relief. Disconnect power before making electrical connections. Connect neutral wire, white or center wire, to center terminal, silver. Ground wire, green or bare wire, must be connected to green ground connector. Connect remaining two supply wires to remaining two terminals, gold. Securely tighten all electrical connections. Failure to do so can result in death, fire, or electrical shock. Before starting, disconnect the power. On the back of the dryer, remove the hold-down screw and terminal block cover. To continue, you must use a 3 4 inch or 1.9 centimeter UL listed strain relief. Acceptable strain release have UL markings on them. Remove the screws from the strain relief. Place the tabs on each of the clamp sections into the hole just below the terminal block opening so that the top tab is pointing up and the bottom tab is pointing down. Hold them in place. Replace the strain relief screws and tighten them just enough to hold the clamp sections together. Slide the power supply cord through the two clamp sections, ensuring the wire insulation is inside the strain relief. Don't tighten the strain relief screws yet. Inside the terminal block opening, remove the center silver colored terminal block screw. Remove the neutral ground wire from the external ground conductor screw. Locate the power supply cord's neutral wire, a white or center wire. Connect this wire and the neutral ground wire under the silver colored terminal block screw in the center and tighten the screw. Locate the power supply cord's ground wire, a green or bare wire. Connect the ground wire to the external ground conductor screw and tighten the screw. Connect the remaining wires on the power supply cord to the outer terminal block screws and tighten the screws. Tighten the strain relief screws. The strain relief should have a tight fit with the dryer cabinet and be in a horizontal position. Replace the terminal block cover. Insert the tab on the cover into the slot on the back of the dryer. Replace the hold down screw and tighten it to secure the cover. You have completed your electrical connections. Always follow your installation instructions included with every product or available online at www.maytag.com.